Kimba Walker Kimba Hudley Walker, born May 8, 1990, is an American professional basketball coach and former player who is a player enhancement coach for the Charlotte Hornets of the National Basketball Association, NBA. He was picked ninth overall by the Charlotte Bobcats in the 2011 NBA Draft. He played college basketball for the Connecticut Huskies. In their 2010-11 season, Walker was the nation's second leading scorer and was named consensus first team All-American. He also led the Huskies to the 2011 NCAA Championship and claimed the tournament's most outstanding player award. Walker is a four-time NBA All-Star. High School and College Career Walker attended Rice High School in Harlem, New York City. During his junior year, Walker played once at Madison Square Garden against Simeon Career Academy and senior guard Derek Rose in a 53-51 victory. Over his senior year, he posted 18.2 points and 5.3 assists per game, earning him a spot on the prestigious McDonald's All-American team. Walker's team finished number one in the nation. Considered a five-star recruit by Rivals.com, Walker was listed as the number 5 point guard and the number 14 player in the nation in 2008. During his freshman year at the University of Connecticut, Walker played in every contest and was named to the Big East All-Rookie Team. He helped the Huskies achieve a number 1 seed in the 2009 NCAA Tournament. He averaged 25.5 minutes per contest, easily far more than any regular non-starter. He also helped the Huskies advance to the 2009 Final Four with a 23-point effort in the Elite Eight versus Missouri. During the Huskies' 2009-2010 season, Walker started in all 34 of their games and contributed an average of 14.6 points. He also led the team in scoring for the eighth time in the last nine games of the season, with 18 points at Virginia Tech Walker was named by the U.S. Basketball Writers Association, USBWA to the first team all district connecticut clinched a four seed in the ncaa's 2010 national invitation tournament only to fall short to virginia tech and finish the relatively disappointing season going 18 to 16 7 to 11 in conference play about walker s professional career walker graduated from yukon in three years then entered the 2011 nba draft and was selected ninth overall by the charlotte bobcats Walker signed a multi-year shoe deal with Under Armour, the first rookie from the 2011 draft class to do so. On December 11th, 2011, he signed a rookie scale contract with the Bobcats, and with the injury of point guard D. J. Augustine, he became their starting point guard for the lockout shortened season. Walker participated in the 2012 Rising Stars Challenge during All-Star Weekend. On November 14, 2012, Walker hit the first game winner of his NBA career against the Minnesota Timberwolves. He finished the game with 22 points on 9 of 19 shooting, as well as 5 rebounds, 4 assists, and 4 steals. On January 21, 2013, he scored a then-career-high 35 points against the Houston Rockets. During the 2012-13 season, Walker was selected with teammate Michael Kidd Gilchrist to the 2013 Rising Stars Challenge in which they both scored 8 points. Kimba finished the 2012-13 season with averages of 16.7 points, 5.8 assists, 3.5 rebounds, and 1 steal per contest. He took significant strides over his rookie year. On December 18, 2013, Walker hit a buzzer-beating jump shot over Jonas Valanciunas in overtime to beat the Toronto Raptors. He finished the night with 26 points and 5 rebounds on October 18th shooting from the field. On February 19, 2014, Walker recorded 23 points, 5 rebounds, and a career-high 16 assists in a 116-98 win over the Detroit Pistons. Walker was awarded the Eastern Conference Player of the Week, having averaged 22.5 points, 8.8 .8 assists, and 5.5 rebounds in the span of seven days. In a home victory over the Orlando Magic on April 4, 2014, Walker recorded his second career triple-double with 13 points, 10 assists, and 10 rebounds. 
Playing against the Miami Heat in the first round of the Eastern Conference playoffs and with teammate Al Jefferson unable to play due to a plantar fasciitis injury, Walker had an exceptional game for. He finished the game with a playoff franchise high 29 points, along with 5 assists, 5 rebounds, 3 blocks, and 2 steals. The effort came in a loss as the Heat completed a 4-game sweep of the Bobcats. About Walker in Boston Celtics Walker made his Celtics debut on October 23, 2019, against the Philadelphia 76ers. He put up 12 points on 18 shot attempts from the field in 34 minutes of play during the 107-93 loss. On November 22, during a game against the Nuggets, Walker went down with a neck injury after colliding with teammate Semi Ojolai. He was taken off the court on a stretcher. He was first diagnosed with concussion-like symptoms and then later diagnosed with a sprained neck. On November 27th, Walker scored a then-season-high 39 points in a 121-110 win over the Brooklyn Nets. That season-high would be eclipsed on December 11th, when Walker scored 44 points in 122-117 loss to the Indiana Pacers. On January 16th, 2020, Walker would post a 40-point, 11-assist double-double in a 128-123 loss to the Milwaukee Bucks. On January 20th, Walker recorded his first head-to-head -head win against LeBron James after having begun his career 0-28 against him. Posting 20 points, 7 assists, 4 rebounds, and a steal, he helped the Celtics come away with a 139-107 blowout victory over longtime rivals the Lakers. Walker was named to his fourth consecutive All-Star game, being selected as an Eastern Conference starter. The 2019-2020 season was suspended due to the COVID-19 pandemic. After the season resumed, Walker helped the Celtics reach the Eastern Conference Finals, where the team was defeated by the Miami Heat. Walker missed several games during the season due to knee soreness. In December 2020, the Celtics confirmed that Walker had received a stem cell injection in his left knee in October and had been placed on 12-week strengthening program sidelining him for the start of the 2020-21 NBA season. Walker made his season debut on January 17, 2021. In the 2021 playoffs, Walker missed games 4 and 5 of Boston's first-round playoff series against the Brooklyn Nets due to a bone bruise in his left knee. The Celtics lost the series in five games. On June 18, 2021, Walker was traded to the Oklahoma City Thunder, along with a 2021 first-round draft pick, 16th selection, and a 2025 second-round draft pick from the Boston Celtics in exchange for Al Horford, Moses Brown, and a 2023 second-round draft pick. Walker reached a contract buyout agreement with the Thunder on August 6, 2021. On August 11th, he signed with his hometown team, the New York Knicks. On October 20th, Walker made his Knicks debut, recording 10 points and 8 assists in a 138-134 to double overtime victory over the Boston Celtics. On November 29th, 2021, Walker was removed from the Knicks rotation in favor of Alec Burks. He sat for 10 games before re-entering the rotation on December 18th after guard Derrick Rose was injured. On December 23rd, Walker scored a season-high 44 points alongside 9 rebounds and 8 assists in a 124-117 loss to the Washington Wizards. On December 25th, in the Knicks' 101-87 win against the Atlanta Hawks, Walker recorded a triple-double with 10 points, 10 rebounds, and 12 assists and became the 7th player in NBA history to record a triple-double in an NBA Christmas Day game. Walker missed games in January 2022 due to knee problems. In February 2022, the Knicks and Walker reached an agreement that he would be sidelined for the remainder of the season. On July 6, 2022, Walker and the draft rights to Jalen Duran were traded to the Detroit Pistons in exchange for a future first-round selection. On October 17, Walker reached a contract buyout agreement with the Pistons. On November 28, 2022, Walker signed with the Dallas Mavericks on a one-year, non-guaranteed deal. On December 17, Walker put up a season-high 32 points, 5 rebounds, and 7 assists in a 100-99 overtime loss to the Cleveland Cavaliers.
On January 6, 2023, Walker was waived by the Mavericks. On July 21, 2023, Walker signed with LNB Pro A and EuroLeague Club AS Monaco, moving outside of the United States for the first time in his career. On October 18th, Walker made his debut for Monaco, scoring two points in 10 minutes of play in a EuroLeague home win over Kravina Zvezda. On July 2nd, 2024, Walker announced his retirement from professional basketball. Coaching career and personal life. On July 3rd, 2024, Walker was hired by the Charlotte Hornets as a player enhancement coach. Walker is the son of Paul and Andrea Walker. Walker grew up in the Sackwarren houses in Soundview, Bronx. Walker is also a dancer. He performed three times at the Apollo Theater for the TV show Showtime at the Apollo. On June 21, 2011, Walker released a mixtape in collaboration with DJ Ski and Ski Sports. The mixtape features songs inspired by and inspiring to Walker. In 2011, Walker signed a multi-year sponsorship deal with Under Armour. In 2015, Walker's contract with Under Armour expired. He subsequently signed with Jordan Brand, a subsidiary of Nike. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the life story of Kimball Walker. We hope you enjoyed learning more about this talented and remarkable athlete. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more content on your favorite athletes and sports personalities. Until next time, stay tuned for more exciting videos on our channel. Take care, and we'll see you soon.